Welcome to this video tip, which will talk about building a comment library for providing feedback on assignments. If you weren't aware, Canvas updates monthly, and these updates are based on feedback from the community. Course instructors have been asking for the feature to bank commonly used comments so that they can provide feedback quickly, efficiently, effectively, and Canvas listened. So now in SpeedGrader, you can create and utilize comments from a comment library that you build. So let's get started. First, we'll go to an assignment and we'll go into SpeedGrader. When you come to SpeedGrader in an assignment, you will now see this comment icon and a number next to it indicating the number of comments you have available in your comment library. You may see a zero here right now until you click to add some comments. Click the comment library icon and the manage comment library tray will expand. First, you will notice that you can enable suggestions when typing which I currently have disabled. You can see the two comments that I already had in here, and you can see an area where I can add comments to the comment library. So if you want to include commonly used feedback, you can write your comment and click add to library. You will notice that a comment added verification window pops up and you will see the new comment underneath of your comment library list. If you want to make changes to your comment, you can click the edit icon and make any updates or changes you need to make and you can save your changes or cancel if you change your mind about needing to make changes. You can also delete a comment if you do not believe you will need to use it any longer. If you click to delete the comment, you will receive a pop-up verifying that you want to delete that comment. When you are done managing your comments, you can click the expansion arrow to collapse the tray, and you will see that my comments has updated to three. Now if I am leaving feedback on this assignment and I want to add a comment, I just have to click the comment library, select the comment that I want to use, and I can make changes and update the comment as needed. Although any updates you make to the grade will automatically filter into the grade book, you will have to press submit on your assignment comments in order for the students to receive them. Now let's go to another assignment. I have opened up a different assignment in the same course, and I can see that I still have the comment library that I was building in the other assignment and the three comments that I had available. Now let's go into another course altogether. If I go to an assignment in this new course, you will see that I still have the same comment library. It's important to know that the comments that you create in your comment library are available to you in any course where you have access to the SpeedGrader. So when you are thinking about how you are going to manage your comment library, be aware that you are not creating comments specific to an assignment or a course, but for a global comment library that you can pull into any course where you have access to leave feedback in SpeedGrader. However, the flexibility of the Manage Comment Library allows you to include a very specific set of feedback for a very specific assignment, leave feedback for all of the submissions that you have, and then remove the comment from that library if you no longer need it. This is very useful if you are in a section with 100 students, you may include a mixture of temporary short-term use comments and long-term comments that you may decide to use and personalize across many or all of your courses. Thank you for watching this video tip. Please review the following guide for more information.